Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Ashley and I'm your Total Woman Coach and we are going to do like a little mini vlog today. I am back working out per se. I'm working out but not really pushing myself too, too much, but I am pushing myself a little bit so I can actually see if i'm in pain with my back when i do certain things so yesterday i did a five mile walk um i did it under an hour and 45 minutes i think even with a little bit of maybe like five or six minutes just sitting by the water reminiscing and just praying and things like that and i just felt a small little tightness in my back it was very little about maybe three weeks prior to yesterday i tried to do that i tried to do like a 30 or 45 minute walk and i was my back was completely tight like it was just stiff i had to ice and medicate and everything so i really feel i really feel good that i'm progressing so today since it's late my workouts are pushed to the evenings because i uber in the morning i'm going to do a at-home workout doing mad fit this 20 minute full body workout she has dumbbells i'm not gonna use dumbbells if i do it'll be like just the little three pounders that i really can't even feel just to feel like i have something in my hand going through the motion but what i really wanted to talk to you guys about is life after 75 soft and i was really determined to lose weight keep it off but really create habits that was going to truly truly keep the weight off and when i got into that accident i was trying to stick to those habits but a part of that habit was allowing me to have like fast food and sweets like sporadically and that sporadically turned into every day. So I literally gained weight. I had gained, I got up to 166 pounds. I got down to 158 by the end of the challenge. And within like between my birthday, taking a break, getting in an accident, all the way up to about maybe two weeks ago i was 166 pounds now i weighed in on last saturday and i'm 161 pounds mind you i'm 5'3 that's a lot of weight and i just had to assess the fact like why are you continuously losing and gaining weight you have no problem doing it but it's the keeping it off that's messing me up the problem is i'm not committed to a lifestyle and I coach about this and I preach about this, but I thought I had a lifestyle. Okay, that didn't work. It happens if you did keto, if you did low carb, if you did Mediterranean, Atkins, whatever type of diet and you realize like these are not working, like just keep trying. Um, so with going, oh, I don't even think I told y'all I'm going plant-based, but I'm saying that I'm saving it for another video. And I have been plant-based for consistently for about a week. I, I had to play with it one week just to start incorporating more and more fruits and vegetables back into my diet. And then like probably last week, I started eliminating the sweets and the meats and the dairy. But we're going to talk about that for another video. This video is about my weight gain after 75 saw. So I want to show y'all what I look like. Do not judge me. I'm just being transparent and honest. Okay. Okay, so this is what I look like after 75 soft. You can see I've gained some belly. Most of my weight is in my belly and thought like this region right here. This is where I gain the majority of my weight. And I'm going to pull this down because this is like the reality. Only people on youtube is going to be able to see this so just know that you guys are considered family to me so this is stomach that i've gained i'm not sucking in or anything like i said most of it is and my weight is in my belly my face always look fine as long and i've dropped the sodium and i've dropped the the carbonated drinks i was drinking diet mountain dews and i was eating nutty buddy bars and 
uh, chips and stuff, just feeling my emotions with food and not prayer. And I had to switch that. So I'm not setting a due date. I'm just going to monitor my weight loss progress and, you know, always aim for a, a pound or two every week. But I'm going to take this journey slow because this is this this one don't have an end date. There's no 75 days, no 190 days. No, this is a lifetime. So let's get into this workout. OK, I'm going to speed this up just a little bit so you guys don't have to watch it in slow mo. But I was really feeling good during this workout. No back issues i was really paying attention to my upper neck and lower back i love working out with maddie because she keeps it basic and simple and she is teaching you about positioning throughout the workout as well i decided to use two small dumbbells um, throughout the workout until i got to the very end and then i decided to drop them because i could feel a little bit of pressure because of the weights um around the top of my back all right you guys i'm all done i was not expecting a sweat because i kept it super slow and steady i feel fine i feel good that was just 20 minutes so my next workout i'll kind of push it to 30 minutes still with a low weight low impact just to start getting my body back in a rhythm i'm not gonna settle for oh i got in an accident I can't do much. I actually did that the first month and I gained a ton of weight. The amount of time it takes to lose weight and the amount of time it takes to gain it, totally two different time frames. And I don't just want to lose weight. I want to keep it off. And that is just changing from who I was or mindset, not who I was, but my mindset, giving myself okays and negotiating things, giving myself rewards per se when it comes to food and giving myself excuses like you're going through something, just go go eat what you want, have fun. And if I could do it in one night, it would be okay. But it tends to roll over. So I just no longer can think like that, act like that, be like that. So thank you guys for tuning in to this video. I'm going to continue to share my journey and just teach you guys as well. I appreciate those who still hanging on from 75 soft. If you're a day one 75 soft person that started watching because of that, throw me up a little hand in the comments and I'll see you guys in the next video.